Hey guys, um, hopefully you all have a great day. In this video, I'm going to show you a real project and uh, how to use function of VLOOKUP and uh, consolidate in a project. So you can see two tables. We have all the items in 2015 total charge and here is the history of these items in 2014. But uh, they are not in one line. I mean that A1 here and we don't have A1 here. So it means that I have to use function VLOOKUP. Another problem that I see here in table 2014, you see that we have duplicated items. For example, A1, we have two data and N2. So first I'm going to mm, consolidate this table because I'm going to find uh, make a new table. Okay, the goal, so again, the goal is to make a table like that. Items of 2015, I'm going to find all the data of 2014 and compare and give a tool to manager to uh, see if the sales has been increased in 2015 in compared to 2014 or decreased. So first, in first step, I consolidate table 2014 because it's not ready. So first select a cell, okay, go to the data, consolidate. Let's get rid of these. Okay. Reference. What is my reference? My reference is this table. Okay, great. Get back again. Add. And usually I select left column. So it has been consolidated. Just make it more beautiful. Home. Yes. And just to have a completely new table. Okay, I don't need this table because it includes um, duplicated items, just I hide it. Maybe in future I need the data of duplicated items. So here, so as I told you, the goal is to make uh, this table, okay, using the VLOOKUP. LOOKUP what? LOOKUP this item where in this table comma uh, which column in this table column number two this data okay two and uh, no exact match false just the point is that here you have to be sure that you put the sign of dollar by doing this, you are sure that the table is fixed for all the cells here when you scroll down. Just hit enter. All right. And these value are dollar currency. No, not this one. Okay, Let's scroll down here. All right. So make it more beautiful. Hmm. Yes, now it is ready. So now the manager has a tool that they can compare the data of A1 as we have data in 2015. They can see uh, its sales in uh, 2014, see that if the sales has been increased or decreased, some item we don't, we didn't have data in 2014 and you can do it for many items you can do it for many years and it is a way that you can analyze uh, and data and be helpful for your uh, company hopefully you enjoyed this video and have a fabulous day bye